Hi, it's Judy Farmer with Great Pilates Now. I'm so excited because I'm getting ready for my trip to Europe. We're going to have classes videoed for you in Florence, Paris, Rome, the Cinque Terre, and some places, beautiful places in Germany, and even Venice. So that's going to be fun, and I'm excited for you to join me there. Today I'm in Toronto at a beautiful place and I wanted to give you a few exercises just to help you to really unwind. This class is for the end of the day when you want to unwind and just kind of get ready to go into the next segment of your day. So the first one we want to do is our breathing. We want to sit with our legs crossed or relaxed in front of you in any way you choose. Okay. And we want to feel that awesome breath coming in through the nose and filling up your chest cavity. Hold. Count to four here. And then on your breath out, exhale, bring your shoulders down, keep exhaling, lift up through the sides of the head or the ears, lift up through the center of the chest and completely exhale every drop of air out of your chest. Let's do it again, every drop of air. Here we go, inhale. Breathing in as large as you can, filling your chest just like a big milk crate. Feel it fill into your back. Now hold for four counts and exhale completely again. As you're exhaling, this time, feel the shoulders come down. Feel yourself lift through the top of the ears. Feel your shoulders become heavy. Breathe out completely. Just press it all out, compressing the rib cage every drop. One more time. Inhale. Hold the chest big. Feel it hold. Don't exhale yet. Count to four. Now breathe out. Exhale slowly and completely. Keep the shoulders rested. Feeling yourself lift up through the sternum and lifting through the sides of the head. Okay. Good. Now we're coming to a more centered place. Let's go on your knees and your hands and gently come into what's called our shell stretch, releasing the back, releasing the day. Another breath. Same way, except this time you're going to feel it into your back even more. Inhale, fill your chest. Exhale, stay. Let your head come down to the mat all the way down if you can. If your knees don't bend all the way, just lift your tail off the mat a little bit and come down. That's fine. Do whatever you can to just release all that air and release the muscles in your back. Let's try one more here. Inhale, fill your chest up. And exhale, stay. Feeling better already? So am I. Now from here, let's articulate your spine by pulling your navel in and slowly rolling up. Just keeping that focused energy inside your body as you roll up one vertebra at a time. Now come on your seat, okay? Take your legs out in front and we're going to work into the front of your body. We're going to lift your hips off the mat and push your hips up to the ceiling. Here we go. Push up and hold. Two, three, four. Sit down. Only three more. This isn't an exercise workout. We're just making your body feel good. And down. Two more. Blow. Push up. Hold. Two, three, four. Set your seat down. And one more. Push up. Hold. Two, three, four. Sit down and flex your feet. Now you've got to get those arms moving. Reach your arms forward and stretch. Here's your nice back and hamstring stretch. Let's breathe and stay. Exhale, stay. Good. Now take your feet outside your mat or just about a yardstick apart and sit as tall as you can. If you feel rounded here, then cross your legs, okay? I want your back to be nice and tall. I'm going to model for crossing the legs on this one. Let's bend the spine forward and then roll it up. Inhale, exhale forward, round your back, reach through the crown of the head and roll up and sit tall. Keep the flow for two more. Stretch, pull your navel back in that position, breathe out completely, roll up, inhale. One more, exhale, feel yourself release completely, feel that low back stretch, isn't that wonderful? Roll up. Now, our favorite powerful exercise for this day is called the tulip. Flex your feet and sit really tall. Your back is as flat as it can be today. Take your left foot, bring it into your inner thigh, 
sit real tall, as tall as you can today. Keep the right foot flexed. Sitting tall, we're going to take your arms up and down. This is a shoulder exercise. Lift, press shoulders down. Let's do it again. Lift, exhale, press shoulders down. Tall, lifted through the chest, press shoulders down. Now you've got a tulip shape, okay? Let's rotate the tulip over the bent knee. Now, this is the important part. Lean to the side and stretch through those muscles next to your low lumbar vertebra. Pick it up and then come forward just the way we did in the beginning. Coming forward, roll up, stacking your spine. Two more. Rotate as far as you can. Keep that right foot flexed. Then lean over. Keep your head up as best you can. Then pick it up. Inhale. Exhale. Come forward. Roll up. You're doing great. Let's do one more. Rotate. Tip over. Breathe. Keep your chest forward. Hold. Inhale. Come back up. And forward we go. Roll up. All right, see if you can keep your hands up while switching legs. Sitting real tall, flex that foot. This one, okay. Now shoulders are down. Let's try that up and down. And press. All right, rotate, then tip. This is the hard part. Feel that stretch. Hold it. Pick it up. And then come forward. Really invigorating, strengthening the lumbar. Sitting tall, two more. Rotate. Now keep that foot flexed while you're tipping. Pick it up and come down and scoop your belly in. Roll up. Great for the back. One more. Rotate. Lean over. Lift up. And come down and reach the body forward. Roll up. Take the arms all the way back, opening the chest. Very good. I hope you enjoyed that invigorating wake up and relax workout. There are complete workouts on Great Pilates now. 50 minute workouts for every part of the body. You'll feel amazing. Try it today.